hey guys welcome back to my channel so i'll be using the mpl charcoal purifying shampoo and the charcoal purifying conditioner apple cider vinegar deep conditioner from clicks pins and detangling comb t-shirt and plastic so now i'm just going to wet my hair just to make sure that i don't i don't apply the shampoo on dry hair and this is how currently my hair is looking like after four months of braiding it. So now I'm going to use the clarifying purifying shampoo. It is 120 at clicks by the way. And this is how it looks like. It has a very soft texture, smells very nice, something similar to the black holes, that's if you know them. So I'm going to apply the shampoo to my hair, also section my hair so that the shampoo penetrates um, my hair and also cleanses my scalp. Please excuse me for that. So now, now I'm making sure that... Um, the shampoo goes well into my scalp and cleanses my scalp. So I'll be doing that in each and every section of my hair. So this is how actually the shampoo looks like close to the camera. So I'm just applying the shampoo to each and every section of my hair and I'll be doing this the entire head or hair. So this is how my hair looks like with shampoo. So now I'm just going to rinse off the shampoo of my hair, but I am not actually done with that. I am, I am going to reapply the shampoo again to my hair just to make sure that my hair it is um, clarified and my hair it is properly washed. So now I'm going to apply the apple cider vinegar or actually spray it to my hair. You can actually dilute it or dilute it or just spray it the way it is to your hair. So I'm just going to spray the apple cider vinegar to my hair just to make sure that I don't have dandruff or actually get off dandruff of my hair. So I am going to rub off the apple cider vinegar on my hair and leave it for 10 minutes. So now I'm just going to spray the leftover vinegar onto my hair, rinse my hair and apply the leftover that is in the bottle again just to make sure that I don't have any um, leftover dandruff on my hair and just to make sure that my hair is clean. Oh, and I do this um, each and every hair wash day because I tend to see that my hair gets um, too quick, it gets dandruff too quickly. So I, I'm just going to go again with the shampoo just to make sure that everything now it is clean and clarified.
So now I'll be going in with the charcoal purifying conditioner and also here I'll be detangling my hair. It actually smells so good. And that's how it looks like close to the camera. Also so soft. I would definitely also recommend this. Look at that. So now I'm just going to section my hair and apply the conditioner to my hair. I'll be doing the same thing as I did with when I was shampooing my hair by sectioning my hair into different parts so that I am able to detangle my hair properly. Look at my hair. So now I'm just making sure that the conditioner goes um, into my hair and into my scalp. You know, it conditions my scalp and my hair and also making sure that I detangle my hair. Please don't detangle um, starting from your roots. Please start from um, the end of your hair going up. Um, going to your scalp i don't know if that makes sense but yeah so i'll be doing that um the rest of my hair So now I'm doing the last step, which is to deep condition my hair. Um, that is how it looks like. I deep condition each and every hair wash day. Please, it is so, so important. That, that is how it looks like. And you can get this deep conditioner by Afro Botanics range at Flex um, 400 here i won't be sectioning my hair i will just be applying the deep condition to my hair making sure that um it is on each and every um part of my hair and also on my scalp as i have not deep conditioned my hair for almost four months now so here i'll be just making sure that i apply it to each and every part of my hair strand So now I'm just going to take my plastic bag and wrap it up around uh, my hair as I don't have a, a shower cap or that deep condition um, cap. So I'll be just doing this um, and leaving this plastic bag for an hour on my head. Now I'm going to put the my t-shirt on my head also just to give it that extra heat nyana so I'll be doing this uh, and then I'll be leaving it for an hour after an hour I'm going to <music> So 
now I'm just going to take this t-shirt to dry my hair and to make my hair a little bit damp. Please do not make use of a towel on your hair. Just take an old t-shirt to dry your hair. Now I'm doing the final step which is to moisturize my hair. I'll be using the anti Jackie's grapeseed oil which you can find at Lix and the native child um, leave-in conditioner which you can find at Pick and Pay Jet or other stores and the hemp seed oil, the strengthening butter by Afrobotanics which you, you can also find at Lix and the native child um, castor oil, uh, oil for my hairline. So now I'm just going to take a little bit of the leave-in conditioner and that's how it looks like. It actually um, kind of, I don't know how to describe the the texture, but it, can, it kind of feels um, a bit, I don't know. I'll just put it on the screen when I, when I remember. But I'll be applying this on my hair as you guys can see. And I, I noticed that I applied too much on the first block of my hair. So I made sure that I do not apply much to my hair. As you guys can see, I applied too much of the, um, the leave-in conditioner on my hair. So I tried to make sure that in each and every block that I'm going to make, I do not apply much. So I'll be doing this in each and every part of my hair. Um, so yeah guys this is the final thing i have um one two three four like in each um section so yeah guys so please don't forget to like comment and subscribe to the channel and also don't forget to watch my previous video that i've uploaded um until next time it's a bye also oh don't forget to follow me on all my social media platforms instagram at bridget dot um twitter at last Muname, facebook listed um until next time guys bye oh and also don't forget to comment and suggest any videos that you guys want to see from me for now it's bye